guys, it's Alicia and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing episode 2 in my shelf talk or what's on this shelf and what has Alicia not read. Let's proceed. <laughs> But this time I'm going to be focusing on the shelf right here, which is directly under the one you guys see in every video. Sometimes you get shots of it. And um, it's the next one in progression. We're going down. That's how it works. So I'm just going to jump in and show you the books on the shelf. And again, it can change. But for now, as of filming this, this is the one you're going to see. Hope you guys enjoyed! The first book I have on this shelf is The Hope of Azure Springs by Rachel Fordham, and I have read this one. Next, I have Yours Truly Thomas by Rachel Fordham, and I have in fact read this one as well. I've read both of those books twice. Next, I have The Lady in the Lionheart by Joanna Bischoff, and I have read this one, and I adore this cover so very much. Next, I have Something New by Joanna Bischoff, and this is a novella that goes with her Daughters of the Northern Shore book. I have not read it yet. Next, I have Sons of Blackbird Mountain by Joanna Bischoff, and I have read this one. Next, I have Daughters of Northern Shores by Joanna Bischoff, and I have read this one. Both books, Sons of Blackbird Mountain and this one, are very, very good. Next, I have The Heart Answers by Colleen Coble. This is a short story, like a short novel, uh, from her earlier works, and I have not read this one. Next, I have To Love a Stranger, which is also from Colleen's earlier works, and I have not read this one either. Next, I have A Heart's Disguise, which is book one in the Journey of the Heart series, and I'll just do this now. I have not read the series yet. I have book two, A Heart's Obsession, book three, A Heart's Danger, book four, A Heart's Betrayal, Book five, A Heart's Promise, and book six, A Heart's Home. Next, I have The Lightkeeper's Daughter by Colleen Coble, and this is book one in a Mercy Fall series, and I have read this one. I have The Lightkeeper's Bride by Colleen Coble, which is book two in a Mercy Fall series, and I have read this one. Next is The Lightkeeper's Ball, which is book three in the Mercy Falls collection, and I have read this one. Next is Freedom's Light by Colleen Coble, and I have not read this one. Next is Love in the Balance by Regina Jennings, and I have have not read this one yet. Next is For the Record by Regina Jennings and I'm pretty sure this goes to a series but I don't remember what it is since it's technically not anywhere on the the front or the side but I have not read this one yet though I do adore this cover so much. Next is At Love's Bidding by Regina Jennings and I'm pretty sure this is in the same series as For the Record but again I don't remember what it's called and I think there's another one in it but I don't remember, nor do I have it, which you will see momentarily. I have not read this one yet either. Next, I have Holding the Fort, which is book one in the Fort Reno series, and I have not read this one yet. Next, I have The Lieutenant's Bargain, which is book two in the Fort Reno series, and I have read this one. And last on the shelf, I have The Major's Daughter, which is book three in the Fort Reno series, and I have read this one. I hope you guys enjoyed the second part of this as we go through my shelves. Let me know in the comments which ones you've read from this shelf. And I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget you can check out my blog for the love of Christian fiction .blogspot.com. You can also check out my Instagram at for the love of Christian fiction. All my other links are in the description box below and I think that's it. I'll see you guys later. Bye.